test is testing for ketones in the urine. It can also test as serum or plasma or whole, whole blood, but of course we're urinalysis, we're going to test it on urine. The procedure for doing an acid test is, let's look at our direction so we know what to do. This procedure must be followed exactly. Number one, remove the tablet from the bottle and recap promptly. Place the tablet on a clean, dry, white paper. Put one drop of urine directly on top of the tablet. Compare the color of the tablet to the color chart at 30 seconds after application of the specimen. The results are recorded as negative if no purple color is apparent on the tablet at the appropriate reading time. Positive results are recorded as small, moderate, or large on comparison with the color chart. Calculations for this are not necessary. As you can see on the chart, small is a light purplish pink, moderate is a moderate purple, and the large is a deep purple. Depending upon your hospital setting, some facilities require that you report out positives as small, moderate, or large. Some just require that you report it out as positive. Know your facility's requirements before reporting any results. Now I am going to start the test. First I take clean dry piece of petri dish and place the folded kim wipe on it to avoid contamination of my working table. Then I am going to take a tablet from the acid test bottle by a clean faucet. It is important to remember to recap the lid. Okay, then I am going to add a drop of urine onto the acid test tablet. Try to add a drop smartly and slowly as I am doing. After 30 seconds, I compare the color change with the provided color chart. You can see tablet color remains unchanged. So I can report my sample as negative for acid test. Here you can see negative and positive reactions. All the sample I have done here are positive. Tablets must be stored at less than 30 degrees centigrade. Tablets are hygroscopic, therefore recap the bottle immediately after use. Each tablet contains one part of sodium nitroprusside and nine parts of glycine. In addition to that, disodium phosphate buffer and lactose is present. Lactose gives better color differentiation. Acetone or acetoacetate in urine reacts with sodium nitroprusside in the presence of glycine gives purple color. This purple color is further developed by presence of lactose. The acid test does not detect beta-hydroxybutyric acid.